The WordPress dashboard, an absolutely critical part of your WordPress website. It's where you're gonna run everything from. But what is it exactly? Well, in simple terms, you can think of it like a backstage area at your concert where only you and other authorized personnel are allowed access. I'm James, this is WP Beginner. Do like the video and get subscribed so you can get hold of more great videos on how to run your WordPress site all the way from what the terms mean to how to build a site from scratch. But let's break it down into three main sections. We've got the admin sidebar, the admin toolbar, and the dashboard admin screen. First up, we've got the admin toolbar. This is your quick access area. All the key things you need right there at the click of a button. From here, you can navigate your homepage, you can check for updates, you can manage your comments, you can even start a new post. So a lot of critical information available very, very easily. Next, we've got the admin sidebar, which sits on the left-hand side of your page. This is your navigation hub. It's giving you access to all areas of your website. Think of it like a roadmap. You've got access to posts, media, pages, comments. It's all there in your sidebar. Lastly, we have the dashboard admin screen. This is a snapshot view of what is happening on your website. You've got things like recent posts, comments, and site activity. It's your website's command center. From the dashboard, we can even start to branch out into even more customization options with plugins. Say we want to add a forms plugin to our page, we can go to the plugins directory, we can search for forms and we can see what forms plugins are available. We can select WP forms, we can install it, we can activate it and from there it's up to you how you want to use it. But the customization doesn't just stop with the forms or with the plugins. You can actually customize your dashboard itself. Customize how it looks, what you want from your dashboard. It may just be down to colors, it could be down to the howdy messaging in the top that you don't want. And if you don't want that, then click this video right here and we'll show you how to take it away or change it.